kiss for you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim welcome to my another video and in this video this will be the part 6 of my video series on app to app audio calling using firebase and synth, synth stk sorry and so now in this video uh, i will be doing the uh, secular view part and the its adapter part so we will try to list all the users who are using our app with this uh, okay so let's get started so now what we can uh, we need can do here okay so uh, so here we can uh, have the method that will fetch all users and here we can create the method and after that we we can create the method and in this method okay so first of all let me see where is the database reference okay so here we have the reference so we can first of all say reference dot add value event listener new value event listener and inside this on the data change method okay so first of all let me see if i have the users array list yes we have this users array list so here we can first of all need to uh, clear the user array, array list sorry so we can say user array list dot clear and now here we can say for data snapshot tss and here we can say data snapshot dot get children and here we can now receive the values inside this for user object and here we can say dss dot get value and inside this value we can pass user dot class all right and finally we can add it to our users array list so we can say users array list dot add and here we will add this user object all right and after this for loop we can display our um, okay so now we can uh, use the adapter so for that we can create a new adapter and we name it as all users adapter so let's click on package adapters and let's create on new java class and here we can create all users adapter and we can extend and uh, we can extend it with recycler view dot adapter and here we can say all users adapter dot all users view holder and okay and here we can create this uh, class and it will extend with recycler view dot view folder and here we can just generate the default constructor and after that here we can also implement all the methods and then we have this activity and we named as context and then we can also say array list of type user users array list and here we can say public all users adapter and inside that we can say activity context then array list of type user and here we can say array list sorry user array list and inside this we can say this dot context equal to context and this dot user array list equal to user array list and after that inside our own create view holder class so we can say view view equal to layout inflator dot from and inside this we can say parent dot get 
context and then we can say dot inflate r dot layout dot all users and then we can say parent and finally we will use the false and after that we can say all users adapter equal to new all users adapter dot all users view folder and here we can pass this view and finally okay so it is saying an error all users view folder and we can just remove that and we can return all users view uh, all users adapter all right and now we can create this all users xml and for that we have we can use the card view and so we can say card view and it will be match parent and wrap content then it will be id and then we uh, we can use the margin it will be 6 dp then we have card elevation it will be 3 dp card corner radius it will be 12 dp then content padding will be 4 dp all right and after that we can use a linear layout and that will be match parent and wrap content and the orientation will be horizontal and then here we will have the image view and it will be 78 dp and the height will be 55 dp and id will be item image and we can uh, have the source as drivable sorry mid map ic launcher and then we uh, we have another linear layout and this time it will be match parent and wrap content then we need the orientation to be vertical and then in this uh, we will have the text view and it will be match parent wrap content then it will be user name then we will have item name then we can say padding 10 dp text size 220 sp then we have text style it will be bold and after that we will have the button So here we can have the button so we can say match parent wrap content okay so here we instead of this match parent we can simply say wrap content all right then we can say text and it will be call after that we will have the id as call button then we will have the margin start it will be 10 dp and the text size will be 16 sp all right so after this now we go back to our uh, adapter class and now inside this get item count method we can return the user array list dot size and then inside this on bind view folder class we can say user 
equal to array list dot get position and finally we can say holder dot okay so after the we initialize the item inside this class then we will use the and create the uh, i mean write the code for the on bind view holder so for that we can here we have the two uh, we have the text view first of all and it will it is text view name then we have the button and here we can say text view name equal to text view item view dot find view by id r dot id dot item name then we have the button let me see the id of the button so it is called button so here we can say button equal to item view dot find view by id r dot id dot call button all right and after that we can uh, set the text so here we can say holder dot text view name dot set text and it will be equal to user dot get name all right so now it the uh, our adapter class is complete but after we and uh, so now whenever we uh, okay so we will implement the call button item i mean set on click listener in our next part of the video so i think that is enough for uh, today so if guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe goodbye